Hiya! Today we are going to have a really quick look at the filter button, which does exactly what it says it's going to do. It filters information on your spreadsheet. In the example, we have a spreadsheet that has a column that says able to work from home, yes or no. And as you can imagine, if we had thousands of responses, we would want a super simple way to filter the people who can work from home versus the people who cannot work from home. It's really easy. You click anywhere in your spreadsheet. Under the data tab up here, you're going to see the filter button and it automatically recognizes the headings and applies a filter to them. So under able to work from home, we can select the drop down menu and we can say just the people who cannot work from home and we will see those responses there. We can select just the people who can work from home. And of course, we're also able to select everyone. This is really handy if you have a Microsoft Forms survey and you have thousands of responses and you need to be able to filter them. When you actually take the spreadsheet of the results, um, it will automatically do that for you if you're using Microsoft Forms. But in general, this is just a really good way if you're managing RSVPs or any kind of spreadsheet where you need to be able to filter one thing from another. And of course, you can also filter in other ways as well. So um, if you want to filter by city or, you know, name, anything you want to do. So I hope this Tipsy Tuesday has been helpful for you. If you like these videos, then please do leave a comment in the comments below and I will be back soon with another video. See you.